up guys welcome back to FNF channel well today I'm gonna ask you what if you only buy the body without the chassis I think you've seen my previous video before but this time I'm gonna use a different chassis one before you follow my video, right? I'm using what? Come on. Okay. Yes. Is a MS chassis. Yeah, that's right. Okay, today I'm going to show you the body. I think you recognize the body. Mm hmm. It's Sunny Shuttle. Alright. And then, what do you get in there? Including the clips as well. Now, what do you think then? If it is only this body, what you can do about it? You can buy anything else with it. Alright. So, let me show it to you. Right? You buy separate chassis, of course. You can turn in anything you like, the color gearbox right and then what else sets of wheel you can exchange it to yellow mm -hmm. and then the most important one is the motor you can tune it straight away all right okay let's unbox it not unbox it assemble all right, catch you guys again. Yeah, prepare the tire first. See the wheel and the tires got an arch. Look again, still blurry. Oh, there we go. Seen the tire with an arch? Yeah, that's right. This one, I'm gonna put it in a sunny shadow. All right, let's continue. Well, as you know, you have to put the bearing shaft first, right? Okay, this one is gonna sometimes it is hard, right? Okay, hold on. See? On the gear, the hardest one, <laughs> which is for me, is the hardest part one. You have to keep it steel. Yeah. Alright. Then, we move on to the terminal. Alright. Back to you. Yes. So, we move on to the terminal. Yep. This is the motor I'm we're gonna use okay all right yeah I'm off it tear them apart first oh, 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 oh. this one is a bit hot then Put the pinion first. Your pinion. Still brand new, this one. Alright. Okay. And we clip it. Sure. Done. Okay. Then we move on to the other terminal, which is this one. <laughs> okay, it's correct. Okay, then switch Put the cover in it as well. But before we do it, as you know, what we have supposed to do is put 
Oh no, drop. Put the grease on. Okay, let me. Not the thing. Mm. Mm hmm. Okay. And we grab the grease. See if it's somewhere. Yeah. All right. This is the grease. Then we squeeze it up here. This a bit. Oh, what? This is go over there. Oh, okay. Just a bit. Oh, not too much. Okay. Squeeze it a bit as well over here. Not too much as well. Just enough. Okay. Then put the cover side here. Okay. Let's do this. Do it. Okay. Then put the motor. No. Before you put the motor in, I kind of forgot I need to take off this one. shaft, the four wheel drive shaft. Hold on. Right, finally get in. Was for good. Okay, then we put the motor in. This should really work fine. Okay. Put the cover. This way, uh, what's going on here? Uh -huh. okay. Steps, and then last thing. Gear on. Uh -huh. Put the grease a bit more again. Not too much. Just all right. Then grab the cover. Right. Then we can give it a test. Let me get the battery. Right. Where's the battery? Give it a try. Is it turn on? Still mm. brand new. The sound is freaking so hot. Wow. Let me check it. Let me check it. Wow. Okay. Still switching so hard. Hmm. Sounds good. I solved the problem. Squeaking sound see the sound supposed to be like this you know why let me show you why because i'm using this gear see don't ever use this gear into here ar chassis it sound like that before all right don't get a mistake use the brown and red gear plus the pink gear for the four wheel drive all right so you will sound smooth like that all right okay then so we continue to the body all right but first 
we need to close the battery first okay we try hold on ah. There. Yep. Then we tear down the sunny shuttle body then. Alright. Okay. Still brand new. Let me open it. Oh. What do you got in there? Get the windshield. Glass, yeah. Then Then you need to tie this one. Okay. Over here. Okay. I'll get back to you soon. So, what do you have to do? If you get the standard one, you get this small screw. Right? See it? But, instead of using this, you're supposed to use this one okay with the washer don't forget no all right so it will look like this so you put the whole thing inside and the position like this all right then you should get a very high gap between the chassis and the body which is good when you put the basic tune on it okay see Hold on, let me put the clip on. I'll show it to you. Because the thing is, the standard one will be low. This one is preventing you from screeching your tires against the body. Right? Hold on. Ah, see? <laughs> then if it's you put only the lower one it will be this tire against this fender not good this one you won't get still high see you can put the basic bumper inside without any hassle right turn it on again see? easy voila Alright then, what do you guys think? Looks good, eh? Different chassis, different wheel, and using a power dash motor. Wow! So, there you go guys, there you have it. Give a thumbs up, and don't forget to share, and comment, and please subscribe. Alright then. See you guys later.